Hello, it's Robin from Mindstorms360 here, and I'm going. To, I'm showing you my latest Mindstorms robot. It's a grabber. It uses EV3, and it's got a double arm, which can keep the end. Can, it can keep the end level. I'm just remote controlling it on the app on the EV3's main menu, and I can use this other one to control the grabber. It can be driven around. And it uses the hard, large plastic tracks with the large hubs. It's got quite a lot of armour on, so it can be used as a bulldozer. Uh, and that's to stop things getting caught in the tracks. It uses the two EV3 large motors for driving. A NXT motor for this, which is compatible with EV3. And a EV3 medium or small motor using a worm gear and a 24-tooth gear to lift the arm. Um, so there is a slight problem with the grabber, which is this. I can catapult it off, but it's com you can swap it for this, which is a claw, if you don't want to use the grabber. Um, so I'm going to do that now. So that's the claw. It's basically the NXT ones, two tribot grabber arms attached together with a 3M beam. That there is no mo power function in that, but it can be lifted up. It can be moved up and down. As you, as some, the some of you who go on my blog www.mindstorms360.wordpress.com, you all know I like building camera holding robots. And this one is no exception. So this camera holder is pretty good, really. Pretty strong, considering I practically ran out of pieces by the time I was building it. So I'm going to attach it on. So there's that. It's quite a, it adds quite a bit of size onto it and weight. So unfortunately, unless your EV3 is on completely full battery, it's not strong enough to lift up the motor with the grabber on. So when you've got the camera in, you have to use the claw. But it doesn't make it go much slower. I, it's probably one of my probably my best camera holder because on most of them they just stay at this level and get moved around. But on this one, I can lift it up to see up and down. So I'm gonna just gonna put the camera in. So now the camera the camera is in the holder, and I can lift it up and down. It's quite noisy. That's just from the motor, but it's even more noisy if I drive it around. Um, so it's, it's quite, quite good for spying as well, because you can move it into places and see around, see around corners and up above things, which is new for this robot. I use it as a like an action cam on the robot, because you can see this in the foreground. So that's that really. I'll just show you a bit of me driving it around. And seeing as I have the mirror here, here's what it looks like with the camera in. So that's it, that's my grabber, EV3 grabber robot. I won't be making building instructions because it's a really complex model, but um, you get the idea. It's very handy to use this double arm piece, well not piece, double arm construction. Please like and subscribe and go to my blog www.mindstorms360.wordpress.com Thanks for watching. Bye!